And one of the schools that opened today wasn't just a new school, it's a whole new concept of how classrooms ought to operate. News Channel 11's Jennifer Silverman is live in Wake County with that story for us. Jennifer. Miriam, it is a new kind of school operating today. Cary Academy is taking learning to a whole new level, beginning classes this morning with something that more resembles training than teaching. Now, if you don't do this, your computer will lock. Cary Academy's 244 oh, students, really grades 6 That's through 10, are back to basics. Though it's likely most know more than a little about computers, their education here begins with lessons to learn the Academy's new software system. Where's that at? Is that that one up there? It's the computer technology will be integrated, whether it be an art classroom, music, um, the humanities block, mathematics, science. Um, it will be everywhere. In fact, classes will coincide with students studying, say, a musical era, while at the same time learning about the same historical period in science. They can also take home discs, adding to their education in class and in computers. I really like it. I was nervous about coming on the first day, but everybody is so nice, and the, all, all the teachers I've met, and I really like the idea that we get to work with the computers a lot. I'm just mainly to learn more about computers since they're, like, taking over the world, you know, and I'm ready to learn. I don't know anything about computers, but I'm ready to learn about them and see what I can do for the world. In the coming year, these kids will give the new Cary Academy an identity, an honor code, even a mascot, an experiment in education we'll all want to watch. It would have been a perfect day, but for a couple of construction holdups, the Student Center and the Athletic Center both are still not finished, but they are expected to be completed by the end of September, Miriam. About a whole new model for doing things there. I wonder, though, Jennifer, what is the student-teacher ratio? That's a good point that one of the students brought up herself. She said, at my old school, I was in a class of 40 students with one teacher. Here, it's 15 to 20 students per teacher, and that just made her much more comfortable. She says she likes the individual attention she's receiving now. Well, a lot of parents and educators like that kind of ratio better, too. Yes. Okay, that's good. Thanks a lot. Jennifer Silverman, live at the new Cary Academy.